happy to have you with us for NBA Basketball on 2K Sports. I'm Brian Anderson, joined by Hall of Famers Doris Burke and Grant Hill, and the fourth member of our crew, reporter Allie LaForce. It's the Chicago Bulls facing the New York Knicks. And so off the tip, it is New York. And the Knicks with possession. So let's take a look at the Chicago Bulls starting lineup. Pass to Reed. To the left side wing. Shot clock at six. Here's Frazier. Three-pointer, Anthony. And it's Jordan with the rebound. That's his shot. And one, I'm sure, he wants back. Here's Pippen. The shot is good. And the assist by Rose. Three no one's ever questioned his court vision. Rose playing unselfish basketball, being the leader this team needs him to be. Anthony in the post. Rebound by the Bulls. To the inside. Rodman, no good. Anthony outside. Pass to Ewing. And there's the rejection. They recover it. Back to Anthony. Tries again. Drives to the hoop. And it's good on the layup. Yeah, that's what you can do when you've got a great handle. Anthony is always able to put it on the deck and get to the rim. And just around a minute and a half into this first quarter. Here's Jordan. Oh, and there's the whistle on the shot. So two free throws for him coming up. his first personal. First team foul. At the line for the goal, Michael Jordan at the line. Two shots. The first one falls. Both free throws good for Jordan. First quarter, just over a minute and a half in. Here's Frazier. And that one drops. Whoa. With his level of quickness, it's tough to keep up defensively. Jordan with it. Here's Pippen. Just five to shoot. The Bulls need to get off a shot. Jordan misses. He didn't make them pay for that weak defense, but they just can't rely on him to miss those kind of shots. Now here's Anthony. Tight defense on him. Takes one from 10 feet. Here's Reed. Oh, the go-ahead bucket, no good. Boy, surprised he missed that. The defense just good enough to prevent that bucket. Now here's Rose. And that one is stopped right through. Now that's the aggressiveness of Derrick Rose, a guy who is relentless when he wants to attack, trying to bend your will to his. And how about our AT&T 5G slam cam? Couldn't have captured that play any better. Here's Frazier, guarded by Rose. It's deflected, and it's going to be out of bounds. New York will have another go. How about that strong defensive performance for this half's mobile one block? I mean, letting them know up front that he's on the hunt tonight and eager to knock away shots. I love it.
And in the first quarter, about three minutes played. Here's Anthony. Boy, a really tough quarter for this guy. Just struggling to make shots right now. Yeah. And they may have talked about shot selection coming into this. Chicago leading. Here's Rose. Pass to Jordan. And slam dunk by Jordan. This guy is putting on a clinic for the people. Man, I'm shocked. I can't believe he pulled that off in a real game. Here's Ewing. Now Anthony. And a foul called on the way up. So he'll take two from the free throw line. That's his first personal. Oh, nice use of the up fake there. Melo got him to bite. And for the Knicks, Carmelo Anthony. At the line, two shots. Shoot two. And he knocks down the first one. You know, that's an interesting point about Carmelo, one of the most prolific free throw shooters in the history of the game. Spends a lot of time at the stripe. And Anthony drops them both. The way he's shooting free throws tonight, you simply don't want to put him there. Rose, the pass to Jordan. Inside. And a strong finish with two hands. There's real synergy in play right now on the offensive end. The pass was right where it needed to be. Pass to Reed. Here's Ewing. Second shot opportunity. Deflected! Here's Jordan. Ooh, he took a hard foul on the shot. So he'll head to the line to shoot a pair. That one on Anthony. I don't mind that. I mean, they met him at the rim and temporarily prevented the points. Michael Jordan at the line. Two shots. Throws good. Jordan. And both free throws good for Jordan. New York trailing. Time called here. The Knicks decide to talk it over. That's a good timeout. They just can't hit anything. Sometimes it just feels like misses become contagious. He wants to settle his guys down right now. Come on and get fouled for your Knicks City Dancer. All right, fans. That was your Knicks City Dancer. Make some noise. Here's Frazier. That one, no good. Good D by Rose. And it's the Bulls' ball. Leading by five. With the drive. Oh, wow. Get out the way, Greg. Come on. Get out the way. And adding to this lead right now. Riding a wave of momentum. Well, if you continue to execute at both ends, you can build on this lead. Now here's Anthony. To the middle. Falls. He's now two of five from the field. Now just such a high percentage look, but with Mello, it's from almost Patrick just Ewing. a given. Tough to stop. Now Jordan. He's got six. Drives to the hoop. And slam dunk by Jordan. 
Wow, that type of finish is just deflating right now for a team that's trying to make a comeback. Ouch, that's certainly a big time finish right there. It was one big exclamation point, or maybe even a question mark. Frazier, shot is off. Great rim protection to prevent him from converting. Beautiful. <laughs> Attacking the rim from with power. Michael Tremendous Jordan. finish. Pass to Ewing. That one falls. His second make in five attempts. This guy can do so much for you on the offensive end, and that is why his number gets called time and time again. Rose finds Jordan. Going inside. Six on the shot clock. And it's Ewing with a rebound. Guarded by Rose. Drains it from nine feet away. Jordan with it. Give him eight points now. Got a piece of it. Here's Rodman. Well, he hasn't put up any points yet in this one. Rose outside. Just two to shoot. No good from outside. And this is exactly who you want taking that shot. He just missed it. Here's Anthony. And he didn't get quite enough under that one. Hey, sometimes the best looks don't equate to points. Pass to Reed. Here's Pippen. He's guarded by Anthony. Here's Ewing. And here's Anthony. No one near him. And the jumper falls for him. He's got six. You know, you love your star players making others better. And Melo with the vision there. Chicago calls timeout. They're looking to do something to stop this run. They have to get back on track. Really needs to settle his guys down right now and get them refocused. So both teams changing it up here. Pass to Butler. To stop the drought. And King pulls it down. To the paint. Here's Monroe. And that's good. His first bucket of the game. They're punishing those late defensive rotations. Getting good looks inside throughout the half. Now here's Butler. And the layup is good. And Chicago leads by three. Boy, Butler took a pretty good hit there, but has the strength and the coordination to finish it. That's pretty. Pass to Ewing. He can't get it to go. Now Chicago takes it the other way. Takes it inside. And the rebound goes to the Knicks. Here's the busher. That went a little long. Here's Armstrong. Well, he hasn't scored yet, but I'm sure that'll change. Pass to Butler. He got a piece of it. Here's King. Here's Monroe. Five to shoot. New York needs to get one up quick. The timer ticks. Here's King. And they get it back. Here's Ewing. And the Knicks miss again. Chicago leading. Two minutes remaining. In Here's the first. Butler. Two minutes. And it's Butler with Jimmy the jam. Butler. Well, there's a solid handle that Jimmy Butler is working with, and his ability to create with the ball in his hands becoming special. 
144 left to play in the first quarter. Monroe with a bucket. <laughs> Once he breaks out the crossover, you just know something special is about to happen. Shots blocked. Count it. All three of his attempts have gone in. The best way to get a clean look is with those quick hitters on the break. What a beautiful fast break opportunity and the finish pretty good. Here's Armstrong. How quiet so far offensively. Searching for his first point of the game. That was a good call. The defense wasn't established. The Bulls making a switch here. Love's checked in. Nick's on D. They trail by one. Here's Butler. And it's Butler who slams it down. Well, a little show and tell from the Butler. Jimmy giving the fans their money's worth. Pass to Houston. From deep three-point range. They get it back. Here's Ewing. Oh, a big finish with a one-handed jam. And I'll tell you what. This is a guy who doesn't take a break at all on the boards. Man, doing serious work. He likes being an anchor on the glass. Well, but as defenders keep forgetting to box him out, he continues to just make them pay. Here's the three. And King pulls it down. And here's New York now. They're on a 14-6 run. Down low. And it's blocked right out of the air and controls it. Three seconds separating the shot and game clocks. Pass to Love. Here's Armstrong. And here's Love. Just five on the clock. No good on his first attempt of the game. From deep. And still a close game as the first quarter comes to a close. Bulls out in front. They're up by one. And back to the start of the second quarter. If you're just joining us, it's been a pretty even game through the first quarter. And let's take a moment here to get your take, guys, on the scoring so far for the Bulls. <laughs> Some great drives to the bucket for them tonight. Another thing that's clear is that they're dialed in from mid-range, burying their jump shots here early on. And Chicago has possession. Their biggest lead of the game was nine. On the court for the Bulls. Outside Butler. Into the lane. No good there. The Knicks go the other way with it. This has been a close game in a lot of ways, but they do have an edge on the boards. Pass to Monroe. Here's the busher. Still getting warmed up offensively. No buckets yet in the game from him. Four on the clock. That shot is off. And here's Chicago. Outside Butler. Now here's Love. From the right block. Good, and Butler oh, gets the assist. Love's got his first basket. Well, terrific floor awareness from the crafty swinger. Jimmy Butler playing the role of facilitator. Pass to King. Here's Monroe. Blocked! And it's going to be out of bounds. New York will have another go. New York ball. Richardson's checked in for New York. Zach Levine, he's checked in for Chicago. Quarter number two, with just over a minute to play. Clock at six. Pass to King. The shot won't fall. Some solid defense from Butler. Butler on the wing. Jacks up a three. And King pulls it down. New York trailing. And he's going for the oop here. Here's Theus. 
looking for his first basket still in this one. And it's good for two. Precision pass into the post. Well-earned assist. Pass to DeBusher. And there's the foul. It's on Zach Levine. Zach Levine. That's his first foul of the game. First team foul. Coming onto the floor for the Bulls, Tony Kukoc. Quarter two and about two minutes in. Here's King. Gets an open look and hits it. Great to see players still working the in-between areas. There wasn't much resistance defensively. Outside Levine. Played it in with a nice That's touch Levine. off the window. And Chicago leads by five. This to me is where Levine's length can be a major advantage. Nice job attacking on the painted area. Pass to DeBusher. Now here's Richardson. Here's Houston. That three's off the mark. Here's Kukoc. Love passes to Levine. Here's Kukoc. Here's Theus. Down to five on the shot clock. Here's Noah. And the rebound paying Jordan off Noah. as they pick up two on the second chance bucket right there. That's a big time offensive rebound and conversion. The passion of Noah on display again. They've been having major problems offensively. Definitely in a bit of a dry spell. Here's Levine for three. He drops it from range. And now it's a 10-point Bulls lead. And what's working here? Each guy is willing to make the next pass. Here's DeBusher. And he makes it on the layup. Nice offense here. Close in. Great bet to go. Now here's Levine. He's got five. The shot no good. And New York the other way now. Here's King. He takes it in. There's the block. Levine against Richardson. Out to the wing. Here's Theus. Boy, he's been patient so far. Nothing yet on the scoreboard. Nice one-handed jam. Simple and effective, B.A. Hey, with the lead, I'm surprised he didn't come up with something a little more creative. Now here's Richardson. Here's Stoudemire. Pass to Houston. Nifty move. And they force the shot clock violation. Great D. Both teams will make substitutions. Chicago with the ball. They're on a 13-4 run. And here's Levine. Driving in. Good on the shot. Zach Levine. Levine's got seven points. And why go away from attacking inside if the D has no answer for you? Here's Frazier. He's covered by Levine. Oh, he muscles it in through the contact. They call the foul, and he's on his way to the line. Oh, what tremendous focus to absorb the contact and find a way there to finish. Second team foul. At the line for New York. Walt Frazier at the line. Find the lane. One shot. One shot. Chicago leading. Now Jordan. Give him eight points now. Pass to Pippen. Jordan with it to the paint. And down it goes. Dunked it through off a beautiful setup. Oh, not the defensive effort they need to cut into the lead. Boy, good call. You have to at least try to protect the rim. 
They're just too slow to react. You can't afford to sleepwalk through possessions. What's going on out there? Well, you get exactly what you want right there. Clean look right at the cup. Nicely done. Jordan against Richardson. Pass to Kukoc. Just five to shoot. And they'll turn it over. Couldn't get the shot off. A shot clock violation. New York. So both teams making some changes here. Substitution. Here's Frazier. He's got five. Over Rose. That went off the back iron and out. Pass to Jordan. To the inside. Lays it up and in off the pretty assist. He has six. And trust me, when the D's slow to react, he'll be the first guy to make them pay. And that's typical of this guy. He's always reading the situation, reacting quickly and capitalizing. Now here's Anthony. Give him eight points now. Blocked! Now here's Jordan. Here's Rose. Over to the wing. To the middle. And Reed pulls it down. And the Knicks with the possession here. 11 point game. Here's Frazier. Rebounded by Pippen. I know he's got to be frustrated right now, but the team is fighting from behind. He's got to stay with it. Here he goes, and he goes in for the dunk. <laughs> Attacking the rim with power. Tremendous finish. They need something good to happen here. Yeah, they've gone way too long without a score. Count that bucket. Anthony's gotten four this quarter. Well, it looks like he has put that rough first quarter in the rear view. He's starting to cook here in the second. Now here's Jordan. He's closely guarded. The Knicks with the rebound. Here's Barnett. Boy, no scoring yet from him, but that's likely to change. Fires from the wing. Misses off the left iron. And so here is Chicago. Inside. Pass to Pippen. Three-pointer. And again, it's Stunning Chicago Pippen. with a three. three point you goal. like how their perimeter game is building out. They're feeling it right now. Here's Frazier, guarded by Rose. Frazier, shot is off. Anthony against Jordan. Back to Rose. And he drives. Oh, big finish. Oh, did you see that? Not simply about feel, right? Derrick Rose in pick and roll situations has such a good feel for the right decision. Next, making a switch here. Now a timeout called by New York. There's just a lot of wide open lanes to the rim here. Timeout. That'll drive your coach nuts. Well, poor rotations, poor communication. There's a lot to figure out right now.
Takes a three. Rodman with a rebound. Yeah, and the defense has really got to tighten up on him. I mean, he's just too dangerous from the three-point line. Man, they're really rolling right now. That lead keeps getting bigger and bigger. And one of the things that's helped that is they're getting it done on both ends. Terrific focus on offense, and they're locked in defensively. Here's Ewing. And he got the whistle on the way up. So he'll be headed to the line for a pair. That's his second personal, third team foul. At the line for New York, Patrick Ewing. At the line, two shots. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. First free throw is good. And that's good as he hits both shots. Boy, a really soft touch on display. It is a luxury to have a big man who can hit from the line at a consistent rate. Now Jordan. Give him eight. Off target at the rim. Pass to Frazier. Here's Ewing. Anthony, left side. Here's Pippen. He's got 12. And here's Jordan. Six to shoot. Rose outside. There's the three. And it's out of bounds. Last touch by Rose. the Knicks now. They trail by 16. Pass to Frazier. Here's Ewing. Guarded by Rose. To the left wing. Launches it. Sinks the tray. Give him eight points now. And that's on the defense, giving him a decent look. That's his shot. Rose outside. There's the drive. Now here's Jordan. And Reed pulls it down. Here's Frazier, guarded by Rose. Well, he's such a good athlete for a center. It's how he's able to succeed despite being one of the smallest fives in the NBA. There's 45 seconds left in the second period. Knicks foul. Willis Reed. That's his first personal. First team foul. Coming onto the floor for the Bulls. Now here's Rose. Guarded closely. Let's it fly. Their offense stone cold. Another miss there. Pass to Reed. Oh, he gets it to fall, and that makes it just a single-digit deficit. Outstanding pass on time and on target. Now here's Rose. He's covered closely. Two on the clock. Rodman, great positioning on the putback. And Chicago leads by 11. And those second chance buckets are major bonus points if you can get them. That'll do it for the first half. Bulls out in front. They're up by 11. And we'll see you back here after the break. Third quarter action in just a bit. It's the 2K Sports Halftime Show.
was a closely contested first quarter for Chicago. Their field goal percentage was a robust 50% in the period. That's something they can hang their hat on. And they flat out dominated that second quarter. Hard to believe they were behind at one point as they're now up 11. And uh, Shaq, what did you see out there from the Bulls? The difference so far has been the efficiency of their offense. The ball movement is really good. They're not afraid to use the whole shot clock if they have to. Overall, they're making every position. Kenny, your take on New York. They didn't shoot the ball very well. That's because they didn't have any flow on offense. I'd expect the coaching staff to make some adjustments in the locker room. They need to draw up some plays to get a good offensive move. Excited first half. We'll see if things play out a little more evenly in the second. Rose outside. Let's it go from deep. Ooh, he's been flawless tonight. Now he's six for six. And just not letting up at all. I mean, you have to love this approach. You want to get the ball to the guys who make plays. One thing we've learned in the NBA, the game is never over. So you've got to continue to score, continue to build your lead. And for Chicago, here's Frazier. Five on the clock. Here's Anthony. Oh, and he got fouled on his way up. He'll head to the line to shoot two. That's his first personal. You know, great scorers first just have that foul. knack. Get inside, it's either a bucket or a trip to the free throw line. At the line for New York, Carmelo Anthony. At the line, two shots. And the first one at the line is good. He's perfect from the line this time. Rose with it. Driving inside, and down it goes. Jam that one home. And this is where Derrick Rose makes his money on the offensive end, takes the action right to the rack. Here's Frazier, guarded by Rose. Pass to Reed. Shot clock at six. Oh, and makes it with the kiss. Six points for him. Probably a play they drew up in the locker room at half. Well, there is nothing better than catching a rhythm as early as possible. And boy, that's a terrific start right there. Now here's Rose. Give him eight. Pass to Jordan. And Reed pulls it down. And if they're going to make a move, this is a good time to start. And, and there's still plenty of time, but they definitely don't want to let this game get too far out of hand. The what? shot's good. We've seen that more than once today. An effortless basket inside. And here's Jordan. Tipped away to the inside. Boom! He jams it straight down. You have to have the vision to find the open man. Beautiful pass. Pass to Anthony. Rose comes with a double. Here's Frazier. He's got 10. Out to the right wing. Ewing, no good. Now here's Jordan. Defense is right there. 
and that one goes. He's now recorded his fifth bucket in eight tries. Well, they're winning largely because of this guy's play. He has been sensational. Now a timeout called by New York. Trying anything now to get them out of this slump. This feels like the basket is looking awfully small to them right now. They're having a hard time getting anything to fall. Your Knicks City Dancer. Well, we're into the third quarter, just over two and a half minutes played. Pass to Ewing. Anthony, left side. Here's Ewing. Oh, there's the alley! Rose with it. And blocked! That one goes careening off the glass. against Jordan. Anthony with a bucket. Anthony's got four points this quarter. Oh, that, that could easily have been a three-point play. A little contact. Mello still goes right to it. Here's Rose. Oh, and that one had the Jerry right Rose. spin on it. It's good. And Chicago leads by 14. Just continuing to pile it on, refusing to let up. That is the competitiveness he brings to the table. Every night you're going to get great effort. New Love has checked in for Chicago. On to the floor for the Bulls. Bob Love. We've gone about three and a half minutes here into the third. Anthony misses. And it didn't fall, but still a great look. You know, it can be frustrating when you make the right play and fail to reap the rewards. You just have to stay with it here. And he drops in the layup off the glass. Nice dribble move to get to the hoop for an easy two. Now here's Rose. He's got ten. Down low. Oh, here's Love with the jam. And just a great screen. And they got a high-powered finish out of it. And my question is, where was the help? Someone rotate over and challenge. Now here's Anthony. 14 points for him. Pass to Frazier. Over Jordan. Ooh, rejected by Jordan. Now Rose. And it's Ewing with a rebound. Trying to claw their way back into this. And the best way to do that, minimize your mistakes and take good shots. Using his size to full advantage, he beats everyone to the ball. Right wing. Here's Pippen. Can't hit that one. New York goes the other way with it. Here's Frazier. Ten points for him. Second chance shot. Here's Reed. Here's Ewing. No luck. They battled on the glass, but they couldn't knock it down. Here's Pippen. 15 points in the game. Out of bounds. It'll be New York's ball. New York ball. And we've got to see that sensational mobile one block again. Yeah, just some terrific effort there. And you know the whole team will get an energy boost off a block like that one. Rose substitution.
Here's Frazier. Pass to Anthony. Here's Houston. Here's Stoudemire. The shot off that time. Some solid defense from Jordan. Here's Armstrong. Uses the glass to finish the layup. Armstrong. And Chicago leads by 16. Some sick ball skills displayed right there. And he's not the guy you expect to pull that off. Here's Frazier. Pass to Anthony. Another miss. Boy, they're in a funk right now. The ball's knocked loose. Here's Love. And it's good. Fought through contact. Hit the shot and will go to the line. And a moment to look at the scoring approach in terms of where the points are coming from for the Bulls. Well, I really thought maybe they'd cool off a bit at halftime, but they've continued to bury those jump shots. Well, you've also got to Let's love stop. how hard they've attacked the basket. All that penetration getting them lots of easy buckets. A difficult situation for New York. Tipped away. Oh, it's stolen by Jordan. The floater and the layup is up and in. Jordan's got 10. Well, that's a nice play. You've got to read the situation and go to your floater time game out, when necessary. And the Knicks call time here. Lots to talk about here, guys. I mean, losing momentum and looking for answers. I think here you have just got to get back to what you do best and then live with the results. And so it's New York with it. Here's Barnett. Well, he hasn't put up any points yet in this one. Out left to the wing. Here's Armstrong. Here's Noah. Goes back up. The rebound by Stoudemire. They're having a hard time stopping this run. And B.A., you can't afford to keep coming up empty. And it's the Bulls with the ball. Here's Armstrong. Knocks it down from distance. Armstrong. He's got five. I love the efficiency he's playing with tonight. Not scoring as much as usual, but he's been effective, and they're winning. Are you serious? That is some power from a point guard. Oh, I love backcourt players with some ups. We know versatility is huge in this game. Just a tremendous job finishing that play. Wow. Here's Jordan. Oh, okay then. The reverse jam. Unbelievable. Now, I know he makes it look easy, but it takes incredible physical tools to pull that off. Athleticism and explosion. And I'm glad we got to see the mobile one block once more. What a play. Yeah, just some terrific effort there. And you know the whole team will get an energy boost off a block like that one. Here's Houston to the middle. Shot clock at five. Here's Frazier. And rejected. 
Well, Joe Kim Noah making his presence felt on the defensive end. From deep, Jordan. And again, Michael it's the Jordan. Bulls from deep. He came out of halftime with renewed focus, heating things up offensively. Here's Barnett on the take. And that one is hammered home. Hey, if you give him room, he's going to score the ball. Here's Armstrong. He's got five. Pass to Jordan. So it'll be Next two free throws. He was fouled in the act of shooting. That's his first personal. Second team foul. At the line for the Bulls, Michael Jordan. At the line, two shots. Shooting two. First free throw is good. also good so he hits both free throws here's Starks and there's the drive here's the busher lays it up and banks it in that'll drive your coach crazy failing to box out and to me this is a common theme that's running through the league right now guys looking to leak out rather than box out now here's Jordan He's got 17. To the paint. Just five on the clock. Here's Armstrong. Up again. Controls the rebound and the putback. They've toned down their three-point attack in the second half, looking to protect the lead with higher percentage shots. Here's Barnett driving to the basket. Oh, and there's a one-hand jam. And look at those moves in the post. And the smooth finish to go along with it. Just excellent work around the rim. Here's Armstrong. He's got five. Pass to Jordan. Outside Butler. Uses the glass on the layup. Butler's got eight points. I wouldn't say Butler seeks contact, but he sure doesn't turn it down. Here's Stoudemire. We've got 123 left in the third quarter. And the bucket counts. And he is on his way to the line. We'll try to make it a three-point play. Defensive foul, B.J. Armstrong. That's his first personal. Second team foul. At the line for the Knicks, Amari Stoudemire. At the line, oh, one shot. One twenty-one left in the third. Outside Levine. Outside Butler. From the high post. The Knicks with the rebound. Listen, we know the mid-range game is in this guy's arsenal, but you wonder should he have moved it just one pass more. Pass to Starks. Here's Monroe. Here's Stoudemire. A rebound by Kukoc. Butler on the wing. Give him eight. And it's in there. He's got ten. Here's the one thing. You know, off the ball, Butler is good. But with the ball in his hands, turn the lights out. Here's Starks. Pass to King. Clock at six. Stoudemire. Powered down after the assist led him to the lane. How good a playmaker are we watching? Always leading, always trying to create for others. And here's Levine. Seven points in the game.
Outside Butler. The three. No good. And so it's the Chicago Bulls with a commanding 22-point lead going into the break. The hustle they've shown on defense has been tremendous. And more NBA action on 2K Sports coming your way right after this. And while we have a chance, let's go to our State Farm assist of the game. <laughs> yeah, just shredding the defense with that feed. Zero chance to stop that. Well, that's what a great pass will do, right? You love the unselfish play. And one quarter to go in a game that, to this point, has not been an evenly fought contest. Pass to Ewing. Here's Reed. Second shot opportunity, and that's two points on the layup. As usual, terrific effort from him. Unwilling to let the possession go to waste. And for Chicago. Back to Levine. He hits the back iron and sinks it. Uh, Zach Levine doing work in the mid-range. He's got that shot in his bag. Yes, sir. And for New York. Pass to Reed. Here's Ewing. The three. They get it back. Second chance shot. Misses the layup. Tremendous effort. Defends the shot and gets in perfect position for the rebound. Poke loose. Fast break, New York. Ball's going up the court. And so he draws the foul, headed to the line to shoot a pair. That's his first personal. First team foul. At the line for the Knicks, Willis Reed. At the line, two shots. And he makes a first. And we've seen some good free throw shooting in the second half. Both teams deciding to change it up. And so he hits both. Now Rose. About a minute and a half into the fourth now. Here's Rodman. That one falls. Nice feed that time from Rose. Well, working off the pick, you see Rose attracting attention and hits the roller in stride. Here's Ewing. Pass to Monroe. Three-pointer. The shot that time, not on target. Now Chicago takes it the other way. Earlier in the game, they held a 25-point lead. Last quarter of play, about two minutes in now. Good work there as it goes. That's about reading the floor. Hits his man right where he wanted it. Driving in. Count the basket. And it's the Bulls' ball. Fourth quarter of play. We're about two and a half minutes through it now. And the basket by Pippen. Absolutely ruthless. He's not about to start showing mercy now. Well, when it's closing time, he's trying to lock the door. He's been going all night. Here's Monroe. Rebounded by Pippen. Shot from the wing. No good that time. 
I think he's gone completely dry. Nothing is hitting. And this is where you hope that he can find something easy so he can see the ball go through the net. And he lobs it up to the rim. And Anthony slams it in. Oh, the pass is perfect, and Carmelo just finishes with style. Soft touch off the glass. You're not going to get stops against him unless you give an effort. Well, if you're just tuning in, welcome. We played about three and a half minutes into the fourth quarter here. To the left side wing. Pass to Ewing. Puts it up from 15. And it's Chicago with a board. Rose with it. Oh, and that one, no question. Powered it down. The B.A., when he gets the rim in his sights, it's tough to stop. So aggressive and a determined finisher. Nice. Ewing. And that one's long. Here's Pippen. He's guarded by Anthony. Rose outside. Fires the three. Doesn't go for him. New York goes the other way with it. Anthony right side. And Anthony slams it in. How about that? He made no mistake on that one. From Chicago with the ball. Pass to Pippen. From deep, Rose. That shot makes him 7 for 14. He's been good tonight. Puts one in the eye of the defense. First triple of the evening. Now here's Anthony. From nine feet out, getting it to fall there. He's 8 of 15 in the game. You know, these are the kinds of nights when he gets it going like this. Melo can be a one-man band. Now here's Rose. Pass to Pippen. Down to five on the shot clock. Let's the three fly. Bulls keep it alive. And he's headed to the line for two. He gets the whistle there. And the foul called on the, the New York Knicks. Artis Gilmore at the line. Two shots. Shooting two. First one falls for him. And man, looking good from the line so far this half. And so he makes both from the line. And here's Richardson. Pass to Anthony. Here's Reed. Here's Houston. From outside, off the mark. Nice rebound. Trying to match the other team's intensity right now. Here's Theus. And he lobs it up top. Oh, here's Love with the jam. You could just see how in sync they were there. That's what it takes to pull that off. Love's gone four of seven from the floor here. Pass to Anthony. Here's Barnett. Four, three. On target from range. Defensive mix up there. He's the last guy you want to leave open. Here's Armstrong. What a play. Just palms the block. It's stolen by Love. And up the court come the Bulls on the break. Oh, and there's the whistle on the shot. So two free throws for him coming up. That's his first personal. Everyone in the building saw the obvious contact. Elbow. Two. Shooting for Chicago. B.J. Armstrong at the line. Two shots. Shooting two.
And he drops the first. The Bulls making a switch here. Second free throw, no good. Now Richardson. It's tipped! And it's amazing. Their slim advantage on the board seems a lot larger than it is. Here's Armstrong. Pass to Kukoc. Sinks it from Tony distance! Kukoc. They are Three unconscious points. from outside. And so far, the defense has had no answer. Well, that's the whole point, isn't it? If you space the floor well enough, it's almost impossible for the defense to account for everyone. Got a hand on it. I'll tell you, no matter what he does, he can't find his rhythm, and you get the sense he's starting to press a little bit. Out to the right wing. Here's Armstrong. Guarded by Richardson. Here's Theus. Just five to shoot. Oh, plenty of contact on that shot. Officials call the foul, and he'll take two free throws now. Man, he made sure to get his money's worth on that foul. Reggie Theus at the line. Two shots. Shooting two. First one falls for him. The Knicks making a switch here. And that one goes in. Two from the line that time. Richardson with it. Down low. Here's Stoudemire. And he caught that pass in full stride on his way to the big slam. And you have to love the focus. He gets hit, but converts it anyway. Second team foul. At the line for New York. Amari Stoudemire. At the line. One shot. Chicago with the ball. Here's Armstrong. And he's going for the love. Oh, here's love with the jam. Well, the coach loves this kind of ball movement. Anytime you create something inside the free throw line, you know it's a good look. Here's Reed. The bank shot, no good. Listen, simply put, he's got to finish that. It's not like the defender was right on top of him. Pass to Armstrong. Here's Theus. Barnett with a rebound. Now here's Richardson. Off with the layup. Here's Theus. The rebound by Stoudemire. Here's Barnett. And counted from 12 feet. He's shooting well, doing his best to keep this offense in gear, but he hasn't had a lot of support. Pass to Kukoc. Here's Armstrong. Here's Love. Oh, here's Love with the jam. Just great offense. The screen freeing him up for the slam. Hey, without that screen, he doesn't get a clean look at the rim. Boy, that's a play you just practice time and time again, and that's the result of the work put in. Here's Stoudemire. Over Love. The shot by Stoudemire, no good. 
Here's Armstrong. Oh, here's Love oh, with the jam. I'll tell you, that vertical ability he has puts him in select company in NBA power forwards. May not have great size, but boy, he plays bigger than it. Now here's Richardson. Nice to Stoudemire. With the drive. From 12 feet. That shot, no good. What a masterful job on the defensive end. Did everything possible to alter that shot. 151 left in the fourth. Here's Love. Oh, that's going to be too many steps. Gets the whistle on the travel. Anthony's checked in for New York. King comes in for Richardson. And the Bulls also making a change. Levine's checked in. And so it's New York with it. Pass to Barnett. Out to the right wing. Here starts. From down in the low post, it goes. Well, that possession to me highlights the importance of creating for your teammates. Here's Armstrong. Here's Kukoc. Throws it up high. Zach Levine. Levine's gone five of six in field goal attempts tonight. To the inside, Anthony. And Anthony slams it in. Doing what he can to help shrink the deficit, but it has to be a team effort. A minute six left in the fourth quarter. Here's Armstrong. It's rebounded by New York. Here's Barnett. And he banks in the layup. Well, they needed this run way earlier. At some point, it's too little, too late. Yeah, but then again, this run came against a team that may have felt it had already won, and you get the sense it let its guard down. And it's the Bulls with the ball. After the basket by New York. Over to the left wing. Six on the shot clock. Here's Armstrong. And a miss there on the triple. It's a four-second differential between the shot clock and game clock. He's just an aggressive finisher there inside. Hey, when you got bounce like that, you feel like you can take on anybody. Here's Armstrong. for Chicago as they get the win. To walk into enemy territory and deliver a performance like that, that says a lot about this squad. They really came in looking confident and didn't let anything shake them. This is what a dominant team looks like. For Ali LaForce, Grant Hill, and Doris Burke, this is Brian Anderson. Thank you for watching tonight's game. So long, everyone.